first time. I have wanted you on the show. Before I even had a show, I thought if I ever have a show, I want Beyonce on the show. Oh, what, thank you. What's taking you so long? I don't know what's taking you so long. I have been asking for you for, you know I've been asking for you. I'm such a big fan. I always said I, I couldn't wait to come out and dance with you guys, you know, but I didn't do it just now. Yeah. <laughs> I'll dance with you before the show's over. I'm dancing okay, with you. Good. I promise. <laughs> so, and happy, it's her birthday today. Happy birthday, Beyonce. Thank you. Now, this is special enough, I think, to be in the park. It's a special thing for you to, to have a birthday like this, to have this big a celebration, but we have a, a big surprise that yeah. is gonna freak your freak a little later, I promise you that. Okay. <laughs> big, big one, and you can cross it off. Not that it's on your life list, we've been talking about this a lot. We started talking about it yesterday, Justin talked about his life list. Yes. He wants to start learning a different language, he wants to, to be better at golf. What is on your life list? I have many things. I wanna learn Arabic. You, Arabic, that seems very hard. It is very hard, I tried. Do you I'm, know any words at all? Not at all, no, no. I wanna learn how to, um, cook. Cook? Definitely. When, when do you have time to cook? I don't. That's why I can't cook. Uh-huh. I'm terrible. Um, I want to learn how to skydive. Really? You want to jump out of a plane? I do. Yes. <laughs> I, I used to want to do that, and now yeah. I've, I've kind of gotten over that. Really? You may get over it. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. I want to also learn how to ba um, do point. point. Ballet dance. You just go like that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, just follow me. Point. Okay. What do you mean? You want to do ballet like stand on your toes? Yes, I tried. I oh, actually really? went to have lessons at Alvin Ailey, and I'm thinking, you know, I dance, I'll be able to hang. So I, I didn't tell anybody it was me. I went and got my tights. I walked in, and I was completely embarrassed. I was horrible. Really? Terrible. I would think that you you took dancing. Did you take dance? At I all? did, but it's 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 way, I'm too old to, to learn how to, you have to start that when yeah. you're like five years old. And that, that's very, very hard to stand on your, on your toes like that. You have to get calluses, it's really hard. Yeah, so now you don't want to do it, that was enough? Well, I still would like to. Yeah, I know a little belly, I can cliche, but. Um, you can cliche. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, that's all I can do really is can the cliche. Can you show me the cliche? Uh, no, right now. No, okay. No. <laughs> about this yesterday. Mm -hmm. I uh, have very little time, so I need to know ahead of time, should I get a bridesmaid dress ready for your wedding with Jay-Z? Are you marrying Jay-Z? I'm not engaged. You're not engaged? I'm not. It's a big, fat rumor. It is, a, but, but do you think it's a possibility that you will be engaged? One day I hope to be, to be married, you uh -huh. know, eventually with children. I grew up with both of my parents and my sister, big family. It's important to me, so I'd love to have a family. Yeah, and so, uh, when will you and Jay-Z get married then? <laughs> I don't know. Y'all seem like a great couple. Thank you. And he is sweet as can be, isn't he? Is he is very sweet, very he, smart. I met him very smart. Yes. I, he came up to me outside of a sushi restaurant uh, years ago, and I couldn't believe I was seeing Jay-Z, and he walked up to me and said he was a big fan, and I just thought, I didn't even think he'd know who he I was. He is a big fan. He's a very cool guy. Yeah. I like him a lot. Now, describe it for people who don't know what he's like, because he, he seems, you know, kind of tough and everything, but he's... He's a sweetheart, isn't he? He is very sweet, and you know, he's, he's a businessman. He's a very intelligent, very talented, very gifted. And so, th is he influencing, I don't know if this is right, but I read that you want to, you're 25 today. Yes. You want to retire at 30? Well, <laughs> I don't want to retire at 30, but I want to be able to, to relax and take it a lot slower than I, I work really hard now. Yes. I want to be a lot more picky and just kind of chill out and calm down when I'm 30. Yeah, well, I think we're going to be disappointed in that. <laughs> I don't think we want you to slow down. No, I still want to make albums and do movies, but just at a slower pace. Yeah. yeah. So that's a, that's a great goal. I think all of us should put that on a life list to, to slow down at 30. <laughs> And uh, we have a big surprise. I believe it's coming up uh, maybe next. I don't know. Yep. Yeah. We'll be right back with Beyonce. We're back with Beyonce. I'm going to wait one more. 
I'm talking to you uh, this segment, and then there's a commercial. I'm waiting one more segment for the surprise I decided. Yeah. I'm drawing it out. Oh, God. I really am. <laughs> it's going to freak your freak, though. All right, so not only, we're talking about how busy you are. Not only do you have this new CD out, you have Dream Girls. The movie is getting so much buzz already. Yes, I had the best time doing that movie. I bet. It, it's changed my whole life. Yeah? It was the best experience. That? I learned so much about, you know, it, it's exciting when I do music, but it's a whole new excitement when I do movies because I'm like a kid all over again and I'm just as anxious to learn and as excited as I was when I first started this. So it, it just, you know, made me appreciate music even more and I just had, I fell in love with something new and I, for the first time, got a chance to to show my chops as an actor, which was really exciting. Well, I'm hearing great things about it, so Thank I can't you. wait for that to come out. And you lost 20 pounds to do that role? I did, I and, did. And what did you do to, to, to lose the 20 pounds? Well, I did, um, for two weeks of fast. Um, it's you did, did you, I heard you did the master cleanse. I did the master cleanse. I don't know if anybody knows what that is. I did the master cleanse also. Oh, I did no. it for 10 days. So you know my pain. Well, I didn't think it was, a, master cleanse is, it's not, we shouldn't call it a diet. It's not really a diet. No. You do lose weight, but it's a cleanse. Yes. And it's, uh, you can go onto some website and find out what the master cleanse is, but you don't eat for 10 days. Yes, and I did it for 14 days. You did it for 14 yeah. days. And you got in a bad mood, you said? Yeah, I was very hungry, therefore I was evil. <laughs> yeah. Well, everybody told me, you know, for the first three or four days you're cranky and then you're not hungry anymore. And I never for one day was not hungry. I oh, was hungry no. the entire 10 days. Oh, me too. And everyone around me, they were eating Krispy Kremes every day. So when we wrapped the movie, I was so excited. That's the first thing I did. I ate a whole dozen of Krispy Kremes on it. <laughs> <laughs> but it was fun. You know what's good is when you add vodka to it. I oh, like yeah, it. I didn't try that. <laughs> Next time. So this album, uh, B-Day, is, uh, you, this is amazing. How did you get away with, you recorded this secretly. How, how did you I do did. that? Well, when I wrote Independent Woman and Survivor, all the first, the, the big Destiny's Child records a couple years ago, it was when I was a new songwriter. So no one expected anything from me. And I just did it for the love of music. And mm -hmm. I said, I want to do that again. I don't want to tell anybody. I don't want any pressure. So I did, and I got in the zone. And Where did they think that you were? I Where was supposed you? to be on vacation. It only took two and a half weeks to do the, the, to do the record. And I told them, don't call me. Let me rest. And they didn't know I was in the studio. And I did, I think, the best record I've ever done. I, I love everything I've heard so Thank far. And I, I love the song. Thank you. That one you're doing a little bit later. Yeah. Fantastic. All right, uh, and you have an all-female band, which I love. Thank you. Not too many people do that. Yeah, well, I know with r and music, it wasn't many female bands for me to look up to, and I figured if, if this generation could see all these sexy, strong, talented women playing these, these you know, instruments, it would inspire them. You I'm all about female empowerment. Everything. I couldn't choose. I only wanted eight members, but I have 11 girls because they were all so fabulous. It was tough. And you went on like a search to, to find them from I all over. I went on a search. Um, I have, you know, one, one of the young ladies is from Japan. It was people from Russia, all over the world that came to the, to the auditions. It was God, really exciting. That's fantastic. Exciting. I love yeah. the band, and I love what you're doing, and you, you're, you're very, very smart. Thank very you. smart. Oh. So, Beyonce, we're going to show you. Uh, I, this is, I just saw this uh, a few minutes ago. This is never before seen footage of you at uh, some age, because we we're talking about when you started singing. Oh, uh, I'm so take a look scared. at this and tell me how old you were. We hear it. Jackson concert. Oh yeah, you going to the Michael Jackson concert? Yeah. All right. <laughs> How old are you there? I must have been about what six or seven six or, or five or so, something like that. So you just were you started just all of a sudden that talent just came out of you and your mother said, Oh my god, you're gonna be a big star? Well, I always love to perform. I always loved Michael Jackson and dancing to his songs, and, and I loved having a mic in my hand and, and performing in front of an audience. And who first, like, you, did you just sing to people and people said, oh my God, you can sing, and you just started? No, I was really shy. My mother put me and my sister in, in dance classes, and my dance teacher, um, her name was Miss Darlette. Uh -huh. She was like, baby, sing, sing for me. I heard you over there singing to the track, sing for me. And I did, and she was like, you can really sing. 
And she told me to perform at, at a talent show, and I started performing. I fell in love with the stage. She told you to do it, and, and that you all of a sudden went, well, that lady said I could sing. <laughs> well, yeah, my parents were in the audience. They had never saw me perform before. And yeah. I was- So you owe a lot to that lady that actually got you started. Yeah, I do, actually. Come on out. Spot this. Have you ever I'm seen sorry. Any, have you ever seen anything like that? I mean, I just Never. see that video and but I But thought... I knew from little bitty she would be a star. I always told her. I knew it. Pretty smart lady. Pretty smart lady. I mean, you must be following this going, I said it, I said it. <laughs> but she worked very hard. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's why she's gonna retire at 30. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's tired. Yeah, no, this is pretty exciting. Yes, it is. Yeah. I can't believe she's here. This she's here. Fun. And now, so you, you discovered her how? What were you doing? Well, she was at the studio, and um, she was the last one. And our parents always come together to pick her up. And I was just kind of sweeping around, and she was, I was singing. And of course, I can't sing. You, so, <laughs> so then, and, and you hear her. And I was singing a song out of tune. And Beyonce finished the song for me, and she hit a note. I said, sing it again. And now I remind you, she was a very shy girl. And how old was this? She was about maybe six or seven. Uh huh. And she sang it. And when her parents came to pick her up, I said, she can sing. Do you know she can sing? And I'm like, yeah, you know, she sings around the house. I said, no, she can sing. She really can sing. And I, they convinced me to let me put her in some singing competitions and dance competitions. And it's been history since. Yeah, well, it, it certainly has. I mean, <laughs> Have you heard anybody? Now do you kind of look for people to, are you, are you trying to spot somebody now? I'm trying so hard. Yeah. <laughs> and then you sign them and manage them. That's what you should do. Management. Yeah, you should be. Well, now, what but should. But there's only one Beyonce. There's a, well, yeah, that's the truth. She's a triple threat, as they say. So what should, I'm, I'm sure a lot of parents go, my kid sings. And, but, you know, what, did, what do you think was special about her that you said, well, no, but she sings? Now, I remind you, when her parents enrolled her, they enrolled her for dance classes. It had nothing to do with singing. She was at a dance studio. Right. But I knew from when I heard that child sing, and then when I saw her on stage for the first time, I knew it, without a doubt, she was going to be a star. Yeah. And it's just something Well, you, you can feel see that in sing. the video, that she's so special. You have that, like, that's, that's adorable. That's adorable. You gotta be looking at that going, yeah, I was something. <laughs> right? It's, it's, it's a real, kind of embarrassing, actually. <laughs> no, but think about it. You and Jay-Z, when you have little babies, y'all you're gonna have, y'all gonna have some cute, special little babies. Oh, right? Uh, <laughs> How many babies will you and Jay-Z have, do you think? <laughs> she is hilarious. I want, I want maybe two children. 92? <laughs> what? What did you say? Maybe. Maybe two. two. Maybe. Yeah. Well, I think you should have more than that because they're all going to be very, very talented, right? I hope so. No, they will be. They'll be gorgeous and talented little moguls. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. All right. Let's bring out your birthday cake and celebrate your birthday. And uh, I'm so glad you celebrated with us. Red, red velvet. I hope it's red. I love red, red velvet. Red. That's my favorite too. Is it? I love red velvet. I love the day too.